I Leo you need to know this right now for March the 13th through March the 14th 2023 universal energies show me what I need to see for the star sign of Leo for March the 13th through March the 14th 2023 universal energies show me what I need to see for the star sign of Leo for March the 13th through March the 14th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the star sign of Leo, for March the 13th through March the 14th, 2023. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Leo. Leo. These are your cards, honey. So, Leo, you have the two of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is you needing to make a decision, but you're in the dark about some things. Some things you just refuse to see, refuse to acknowledge, a lack of information, block communication. So it's hard for you to make an informed decision in this position. But this is also a card of you being closed off, blocked off, not wanting to see, wanting to ignore, wanting to turn a blind eye. So Leo, listen, you can tell me that you're indecisive here or you're blocking. Clarify the two of swords for Leo. Clarify the two of swords for Leo. Clarify the two of swords for Leo. It is clarified with the six of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone from your past. Flashback from the past. Full-fledged in the flesh. Someone from your past is back. Now, you can be reminiscing on someone from your past, remembering someone from your past, but something or someone from the past is being revisited. This is twin flame energy. This is reconciliation energy. So listen, Leo, you could be having feelings of nostalgia, wanting to reunite with this person from your past. You can tell me that someone from your past is in the picture. Someone from their past is in the picture. Something from the past is being brought back up here. Or this involves children. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me that, hey, you're indecisive about whether or not to reunite with this person from your past. However, you can tell me that you're blocking them because someone from their past is in the picture or something from the past is being brought back up here. You're just now discovering it and now you're blocking them. Leo, you have the three of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is heartbreak. This is pain. This is suffering. This is agony caused by a third party situation. So when I say third party, yes, a romantic third party. But this could also be meddling family members, friends, co-workers, neighbors, anyone being involved in you guys' relationship that shouldn't be that is causing you heartbreak. So Leo, listen, you're telling me that you're hurt. Now, you could be hurt because your feelings are hurt, or you're hurt because there's a third party. Clarify the three of swords for Leo. Clarify the three of swords for Leo. Clarify the three of swords for Leo. It is clarified with the Ace of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love. A brand new beginning in a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing. A brand new blessing. A brand new beginning in love. So Leo, listen, new love, new start to love or a blessing here. Now, Leo, you can tell me that you're hurt because they had a third party. They had new love. And this is the reason why you're just blocking them out. However, Leo, are you hurt and contemplating starting new with this person because they're wanting to reunite with you? even though they hurt you. You can tell me that your feelings are hurt over some type of blessing, maybe something that happened in the past. Leo, you have the Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is you being anxious, worried, stressed, 
replaying things over and over in your mind, lose this sleep at night, worried about something. So Leo, listen, you're all up in your head, stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep, bothered by something here. Clarify the nine of swords for Leo. Clarify the nine of swords for Leo. Clarify the nine of swords for Leo. It is clarified with the two of swords again. So like I said, you can tell me that you're indecisive here or you're blocking. Now, Leo, you can tell me that this whole situation stressed you out and you just want to block them, okay? However, you can tell me that you're a little stressed because you're indecisive here, needing to make a decision here, or maybe rather not to reunite with them, forgive them, and start new here. Leo, you have the three of wands. Aries, Leo or Sag, this is you waiting, waiting for your ships to come in, waiting for what you set your intentions towards to manifest. Now, this is also a card of you looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand. So, Leo, you can tell me that you're waiting. You can tell me that your ships are here. You can tell me that you're looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand or even travel. Clarify the three of wands for Leo. Clarify the three of wands for Leo. Clarify the three of wands for Leo. Leo, you're at the bottom of the deck. It is clarified with the Hierophant. Could be dealing with a Taurus, but the Hierophant speaks to the leader of a religious organization, the leader of a metaphysical organization. This is a clergyman, a pastor, a preacher, a teacher, a coach, a mentor, a counselor, someone of wise counsel. This is the institution of higher learning. This is a corporate institution. This is the marriage card. So Leo could be dealing with a Taurus, you can tell me that you guys are in a commitment. Someone may have commitment on the brain here. This can be about forgiveness. This can be dealing with an institution, organization, governmental agency, religious differences or values. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Clarify the Hierophant for Leo. Clarify the Hierophant for Leo. Clarify the Hierophant for Leo. It is clarified with the Three of Swords again. Uh, so, Leo, you can tell me that you're hurt. Like I said, you could be hurt because your feelings are hurt or you're hurt because there's a third party. You know, maybe you're waiting to see whether or not you can forgive them or not. Just need some time. Or you're telling me that forgiveness is just off the table because it's bothering you. And you're just wanting to look to see what else is out there. Leo, you have the sun. This is you, Leo, but the sun symbolizes exuberance, illumination, happiness, joy, peace, love, abundance, growth and development and freedom. So, Leo, this is you. Clarify the sun for Leo. Clarify the sun for Leo. What about Leo? What about Leo? Clarify the sun for Leo, it is clarified with the moon. <laughs> Could be dealing with a Pisces, but the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. So Leo could be dealing with a Pisces, but you can tell me that you're in the dark concerning something. You can tell me that you're using your intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon. For Leo, clarify the moon. For Leo, clarify the moon. For Leo. It is clarified with the three of pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is making plans to meet up, making plans to partner up, to work together on a contract or a project. This is teamwork. This is collaboration. Now, this can speak to there being a third party involved, but this can also speak to you being willing to work on it or put in the work. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me that this is all work or business. You can tell me that you're willing to work on it, willing to put in the work. You can tell me that this was some type of an agreement or a contract collaboration or there was a third party. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me that, you know, maybe there's an element of the unknown. You're using your intuition on whether or not you want to work things out with this person. Because maybe you're just kind of indecisive here, maybe wanting to wait to see whether or not you can forgive them. You're indecisive on whether or not you want to reunite. 
However, Leo, you can tell me that something was illuminated, something came to light, a secret about there being a third party here. And this is the reason why you're just blocking them out and you're wanting to look to see what else is out there. Leo, you need to know this right now for March the 13th through March the 14th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share, and follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Maj, M-A-J, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.